What is going on guys, it is your boy Tropical NHL back here today for another update about the Montreal Canadiens. Eric Angles have tweeted a couple of minutes ago talking about the Canadiens lineup. We made a video earlier today talking about the projected lines for the Canadiens, but apparently things have changed. And Harry Angles just tweeted it on Twitter. So... Uh, let's look right into it. So we said Doc goes to top line 22 14 77. So apparently Kirby Doc is now playing on the top line with uh, Suzuki and Caulfield. So uh, they played him there instead of Mike Hoffman. Uh, the Anderson, the Vorak, Gallagher line looks the same. It's exactly the same. And a thing I don't like about those lines is I was hyped. I was hyped. To see Yuri Slavkovsky play with Monaghan and Doc finally be able to play in an offensive role with offensive players. But now he's playing with Pizzetta and Jake Evans on the fourth line. He's probably going to play eight minutes tonight. But he's just coming back from an injury. So I'm I'm okay with it. I'm okay with it. But like, don't play him like that every game. When will Yuri Slavkovsky get the chance to play with offensive forwards i don't get it but all right i was hyped to see him with dog and monahan but i guess it will be from for some other time so um caulfield suzuki doc anderson devorak gallagher mike offman monahan joel armia pedzetta evans and Slavkovsky, and uh, the defense looks the same. Guli Sava, Aris Kovacevic, and Jack I with Chris Weidman. And Jake Allen gets the start. Um, yeah, I, I, re I really... I'm hyped to see Doc with Suzuki and Caulfield. I've been saying it for a long time that I wanted to see this. But uh, I was hyped as well to see Slavkovsky finally be playing with some offensive talents in the NHL, and now he's playing with Pezzetta and Jake Evans. Um, yeah, Jake Evans is perfect. Pezzetta, it could work, it could work. I just hope that he plays more than 10 minutes tonight, uh, even though he's back from an injury. He's 18, he heals quick, he heals quick. Um, so yeah, that's it, Doc. Uh, will Doc be the perfect fit for Suzuki and Caulfield? Two right hand, three right-handed players on the first line. I'm not a big fan of that though. But like, there's too many right-handed players on that team. So, uh, what can I say? Um, I hope that Slavkovsky does well. I hope he gets the ice time he deserves, and I hope he will finally play with some offensive players soon enough. Um, he needs that as an offensive player. You're putting him on a defensive role. It's probably not gonna work. That's my opinion. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm not. We'll see tonight for the game. Uh, I'll change my prediction since they changed the lineup. I say 4-2 uh, St. Louis. 4-2 St. Louis. I was 4-1 Montreal. I'm 4-2 St. Louis. I think that Doc uh, Suzuki and Caulfield will um, kind of be slow to work on their chemistry. So I don't think that the line will do as good. Uh, I take a goal from Gallagher, man. I take a goal for, from Gallagher. Uh, for the two, a goal from Gallagher and a goal from uh, Sean Monaghan. And um, yeah, hat trick from Tarasenko, man. <laughs> so yeah, let me know what you guys all think about this in the comments below. Are you guys hyped to see Doc on the first line? Are you disappointed seeing Slavkovsky again on the fourth? Let me know in the comments below. At least Offman's not on the first anymore. That's all right. So yeah, I'll see y'all later tonight for a hat review. Bye-bye.